This baker uses algae in his pastries because growing the plants helps to absorb CO2. French baker Ludovic Gerbois is trying to win his countrymen over by adding eco-friendly algae to his pastries. Wir müssen ja nicht was äh, die Algen einfach appetitlich machen und das muss jeder in Ansprechens bitte. Gerbois came up with the idea alongside scientist Thomas Bruck from the Technical University of Munich, TUM. Bruck manages the TUM Algae Tech Center, which grows algae using climate simulations. Gerbois says people were hesitant at first, but after tasting the confections, he says they've come around. Also, it's clear in Bayer is what is in the Ness, and fish mag it not, and it's clear that it doesn't so good function. And then, so bald that they thought that it doesn't taste like fish, but it's a bit nutty, then it's not a problem. Brock says that not only does the ingredient taste good, it has a massive role in absorbing carbon from the atmosphere. Algae is actually the new superfood, which is also climate relevant, because algae naturally CO2 braucht, um to wachsen. Und die Alge hat etwa drei bis viermal höhere photosynthetische Effizienz als jede Landpflanze, wächst damit zehnmal schneller und verbraucht aktiv CO2. Wir können also den Klima nutzen, indem wir Algenprodukte essen.